I'm in the South Carolina locker room with Melvin, long boy, Ingram. How are you, Melvin? Holly Rowe. Good to finally meet you. And your makeup. Melvin, congratulations on beating Clemson tonight. It was no big thing, Holly. In fact, I heard we actually dropped in the polls because Clemson is so freaking bad. Wait, Holly. Listen. Do you hear that? Hear what? I can hear Clemson's coach Dabo Swinney still talking through the walls. The game has been over for two solid hours and he is still talking. That Auburn post-game sermon he preached made our top ten bloopers of the year. A true riot. Inbreeding should be avoided. Case in point. So Melvin, what did you think of Touch Boyd? Well, his breath stinks. I now know that. He also told me and Clowney and Ingram that our nuts stink, so I guess we are even. Tell me about Mike Bellamy. He's as small as a fourth grader but very fast. He would be better, but he keeps slipping on all of the money that falls from his uniform. And what about Sammy Watkins? Who? Sammy Watkins, Clemson's wide receiver. I don't know who he is. Perhaps he is a walk-on. Did you prepare hard for Clemson? Not really. We spent much more time prepping for the Citadel. They were better and stronger than Clemson. This last week has been more of a fun week for us. The old ball coach said he knew he could count on that boy to come through, and boy did he ever. His road record is worse than Andre Bowers. Thanks for your time, Melvin. Enjoy the NFL. Maybe you will see Touch Boy there? You were very funny.